Cycles, power, phase one. Allison is just completing her, her 15 minute warm up on the trainer, getting her core body temperature up, um, warming up the muscles and getting ready to do some plyometrics. And next she's going to get off the bike, sit down in a chair, keeping her head up above her knees and quickly change into tennis shoes where she will then begin a quick plyometric set. While she's changing her shoes, the plyometric set will be squat jumps onto the step bench, something we call slesus, explosive lunges, and then she will finish up with squat jumps before getting back on the bike for a set of sprints. My laces were all too loose, note. Make sure that you have good condition running or cross training shoes with a lot of cushion. And remember, perfect form. Full feet on the landing on the bench. She's landing nice and light. You can hardly hear her landing and she's exploding up, landing on the box. 10 of these. Just so you know, we're doing them at about 8,900 feet, I think, too. So, Allison's heart rate is going up. Nice. Next come the explosive lunges, and she's gonna go for big air, pushing off, big push, big push. 10 on each side. Excellent form there, knees not coming past the toes. Minimal time, minimal contact on the ground with that foot or on the step. She's pushing off, big air. And as soon as she gets to 20 of these, here we go, last thing squat jumps just on the on the ground push up push up again minimal contact the floor is a hot potato push up big air push push excellent job walks over has a seat in her chair quick change back into the cycling shoes now that her heart rate is really up careful to keep that head up high as possible quick change of her shoes here. You see she's not wasting any time and she's going to pop up on the bike. Spin for a couple of minutes. We are condensing this just for video purposes. So you could spin for two minutes if you needed to. Let that heart rate come back down. Get comfortable on the bike. And you're going to do three sprints here. The first one is going to be slightly undergeared in a, approximately a 53-17 and she's going to do this one seated when she's ready. 10 second sprint at the most. And here she goes. Up, 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 up. Push, 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 push. Go, go, go. Come on, Powers. Dig. And stop. Nice job. The key here, you guys, is you want to start tracking your maximum power for these sprints. 741. Nice job. 741, remember, we are at altitude. We figured out that that's about, mm, I don't know, 1,270 watts down at sea level. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. You saw, even though she was putting out a maximum effort, her upper body was nice and quiet, and she was putting all that power into the pedals. Next sprint is going to be standing in approximately a 53-15 gear. Talk to your coach about what gearing you should use. But this one is going to be out of the saddle. And the goal is to explode in that first one second, hit that maximum power, and hold on for nine more seconds. Up, 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 up. Here she goes. Go, go, go. Dig, 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 dig. Go, 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 go. Three, two, one. Stop. Power should have gone up a little bit on this one. With, there we go. Again, you would be taking one to two minutes here. I would suggest taking the full two minutes when you first start these. 
we're doing shorter time periods just for the sake of our video purposes. So our last sprint is going to be a 5313. And we'll let Allison start when she's ready and we'll count it down for her. Ready, set, go. Go, up, 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 up. Come on, dig, 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 dig. Go, go, five, four, three, two, one, stop. And now you go into an easy, easy gear. Spin it down for two minutes. Take three minutes if you need to, because you're gonna go on to now your second set of plyometrics, just like the first one. And repeat this one to two more times, depending on what your coach has asked you to do. What was that one? 820, I was tired. All right, well, we've been practicing too. Nice job. Thanks, Allison.